we're taking a deep dive into the Clark County School Board. You've had a lot of questions about some of the decisions that have taken place in recent months, so we wanted to get a little more insight into how this board functions. I tried to speak with Board President Evelyn Garcia Morales, but she didn't respond, so I sat down with former board member Dane Watson, who left his interim position on the board earlier this summer. If somebody from the community comes up to you and says, what is this board really like? What would you tell them? Um, I would say that there are uh, definitely some of the hardest working, um, some uh, times it is more difficult because they have a different way of thinking. I mean, that's just normal. In, in any type of uh, uh, governmental agency, there's different views on uh, things, so that's what you get. It's not any different from any other, uh, whether it be at the state legislature or the local school board. It's always going to be d individuals with different uh, views on issues. Different views, but do you think that everybody that's on the board has a vested interest in seeing this district succeed? I would hope so. But you're not confident? I would hope so. And coming up in our next half hour, we're going to examine some of the board's policies and talk to Dan Watson about what he thought going in and what it was like being on the board, all to give you a better idea of how this board functions. Anjali?